This essay example, as well as thousands of others, is available in text format on our website for free and without registration. Simply Google Ivy Panda Free Essays. The role of horror movies in society remains one of the most controversial issues nowadays. Not many people are able or eager to understand the true worth of horror films as a separate genre. As a rule, the main purpose of such a movie is to awaken the feeling of fear or disgust among viewers, and its classification is based on the menace depicted in the film. Some people cannot understand why such movies are necessary in a world where violence and cruelty spread fast. It is hard to define the quality of a good horror film as each country offers its own ideas and visions of horror in modern life. For example, the movie Dogtooth is an example of how Greece understands the essence of the horror genre and uses everyday problems and living principles as the main ideas in the horror genre. Its director, Yorgos Lanthimos, introduces a family with its own rules and truths. There are no definite monsters or bad guys in the movie but it is still regarded as a horror movie due to its tone and ideas and the emotions elicited. Dogtooth is classified as a horror film due to the presence of certain horror elements such as intense atmosphere, sex relations, uncanny concepts, and violence. Still, in comparison to several horror movies, the attempt of Yurgos Lanthimos to define family relations and care as the main threat for society is regarded as unique and even educative as it provides the viewers with a chance to understand better the worth of family and not to turn this type of relations into a horror of every day. Life Many critics and experts in the film industry underline that it is not easy to give a concrete definition of a horror film because the film industry itself is not especially consistent in the way it defines and promotes horror cinema. The horror genre is characterized by unpredictability and a kind of amorphousness. This is why people like watching such kinds of movies. They do understand that something scary should take place, but still, they cannot predict the development of the events. This is what excites many viewers in the horror genre, on the one hand, they may control the situation and realize that it is just their imagination, on the other hand, they are under the power of fear and are not able to overcome panic as soon as they want it. Such reactions and attitudes to horrors provoke several disputes, the main purpose of which is to define whether horror films are necessary for society or not. The peculiar feature of the Greek film Dogtooth is that not all people define it as a horror movie. Someone may call it a thriller or even a drama. Still, Dogtooth has to be considered a movie of the horror genre because of the horror elements observed and the themes discussed. If a person accepts Dogtooth as something scary, unpleasant, and even disgusting, such a movie should be connected to the horror genre. The point is that characters and scenes from horror movies permeate our cultural consciousness, and the characters and ideas of Dogtooth make people understand that family relations are not that perfect. Much depends on how parents understand their duties and try to bring up their children. The way of treatment used by the father of the family is impressive indeed and makes him the main scary creature in the movie. The director wants to show that having an ugly face, horrible habits, or a wrong understanding of reality is not always necessary. To become a monster, it is enough to define control as the main weapon in the family and use imprisonment as the main method of child education. There are many different ways that can be used to classify Dogtooth as a horror movie. Hutchings offers to apply their theory of Freud about the uncanny to identify the main approaches of horror films. Freud defines the uncanny as an aesthetic or cultural dimension beliefs, ideas or experiences that have been repressed or surmounted but which still linger inside us. The father from Dogtooth is a perfect example with several uncanny qualities. First, he introduces the concept of a dogtooth, according to which his children can leave the house in case they lose a dogtooth. Second, he makes his children believe that planes in the sky are nothing but toys. Finally, Parents find it normal to use the wrong definitions of different words. For example, when the older daughter asks what cunt means, the mother says that a cunt is a large lamp. Example, the cunt switched off and the room got all dark. 
such an attitude to child education is weird or even uncanny concerning ordinary norms and rules. The alternation of sex and violence scenes in the movie is another important element of a horror movie. At the beginning of the film, it becomes strange and disgusting to watch the father, who brings a young girl, Christina, to his son in order to pleasure him, or who uses fake blood to show that a cat mauled to death their older unseen brother to make his family kill a stray cat cruelly. In fact, such development of family relations is not only strange but, more importantly, horrible. Intense atmosphere, inability to trust family members, and the desire to create their own rules, which contradict social norms, are the factors that make the viewer believe that he, she is watching a horror movie. In fact, Dogtooth is one of the movies that helps to realize that people are able to create hell at any possible place, at work, home, etc. It is a horror film as it opens many people's eyes to a simple truth, any person can make mistakes and wrong conclusions. It is necessary to find powers and admit personal weaknesses, otherwise, human life may become miserable and similar to real horror. In general, Yorgos Lanthimos may be considered a real genius of the horror genre. He does not use too scary settings or ugly images. He focuses on everything that surrounds people in everyday life and uses family as the main source of evil. Dogtooth is a work with a clear moral value that underlines the role of family and defines the absence of freedom and free will as the element of a horror movie. This film contains a number of lessons for the viewer, and one of the most crucial ideas is that people are not always able to control their desires and use logical explanations of events. It is really hard to create a good family, and people are free to experiment and rely on personal interests and preferences. Still, when the desire to protect a family grows into an obsession, a person is not able to define where something good or something bad is. That is when a true horror begins. If you want to find more works like this essay on Dogtooth, Greek understanding of horror films as a separate genre, head over to ivypanda.com. It has a collection of free samples with thousands of submissions covering virtually all academic subjects. No registration required to access it.